Summer has arrived, and Appalachian Wireless has a great sale on the world's hottest smartphone from now to the end of the month. You can get the amazing iPhone 13 for more than half off because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. Saturday, July 9th, an abandoned apartment complex on Joseph Avenue in Williamson, West Virginia, caught fire, leading to a total loss of the structure. Arson is suspected. Williamson Fire Department is working with the West Virginia State Fire Marshal's Office and Williamson Police on the investigation. The, the apartment complex has been vacant for quite some time, so there were no utilities and raised a suspicion for arson. So we uh, initiated an arson investigation, worked up here for about an hour, uh, obtaining what evidence we could find and then securing the property before we left, uh, checked for extension to make sure there was no fire anywhere else. Uh, we were gone for about an hour and received another call of heavy smoke coming from the same apartment complex. So we were uh, back on the scene around 1130 um, to find really heavy smoke, a lot of fire from the first floor. Uh, we were able to, to, to make an interior attack again, once again, extinguish that fire. And then uh, we were able to go on to the second floor, found two more spots of fire on second floor. Those were extinguished really quickly advanced to third floor and found that the entire attic was burning. As the fire engulfed the roof, it led to a pancake collapse of the remaining levels. The Williamson Fire Department worked for 34 hours to contain the fire, which is currently still smoldering. It's still smoldering behind us, you can see. Um, we, we still have a lot of collapse down in the basement. Uh, there's nothing we can do with that other than just let it, let it burn itself out. Um, like I said, we're still working on investigations and the structure itself at this point is, is unsafe. Uh, we've roped it off for the safety of the public and as soon as the investigation, uh, as far as the physical evidence that we can see, there's not much left now, but as once the, the fire marshal's office finishes their investigation, should be today, we'll be able to get some machines in and, and take down the walls uh, just for safety of the public. The complex that caught fire is between two additional abandoned buildings. Williamson is currently working with the West Virginia Department of Environmental Protection on a plan to demolish the buildings. For Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.